Hello and welcome to jobskillshare.org. So today I'm going to be sharing something pretty cool with our community and our members. I usually get messages like, Danish, I am going for an interview. Do you have something that I can review quickly? Or Danish, I want to learn things quickly, but I don't want to watch a video for four hours or three hours or five hours. Do you have something different? Do you have any other resources? And this is always a challenging thing for us because we are skills-based uh, platform and to show skills to someone, you have to really like tell them, no, you have to really go back to the fundamentals and then do this. So you need to watch this video and then you need to do this, this, this. So Imagine, I mean, that's not easy for us to, you know, kind of like give that answer because we didn't have an ability to say, hey, okay, why don't you just go and go read some blogs that we have created? So just a short story. Uh, one of our member, John, his name is John. He took our live training. He got the job. So when he got the job, before even the job, he loved the live training and he's like, I want to give back something to the community. So when he took the live training, he created a blog on each and every subject that he has taken for 15 hours. So what you're seeing in front of you is an actual paid content that somebody paid a lot of money, but that person just gave us this documentation to say thank you. Now, of course, we said to the person, we're going to make sure that everybody else take advantage of this. This is not just for us. So we put it available for free to a lot of people because the person wanted to give back to the community and we didn't want to charge for this stuff, uh, you know, and so it's free. So we put it on this page and a lot of people co commented, um, you know, came back to in emails and messages that, hey, say thank you to John. So first of all, I want to say, I want to acknowledge that, that this is somebody else's work for you so you can take benefit. Uh, but they already paid a lot of money when they took that time with us. Of course, that's a different value because if somebody's spending 15 hours live, they're getting a lot of server access, more testout.com access, so many different things for career development, but that's a different story, right? Today, my focus is that how can you utilize this so powerful one page? This is a one page, one link, and it has everything that you will need to be able to be successful in the beginning. But I'm going to show you a surprise at the end because... A lot of people may even not be satisfied with this because this right here is we we call in-demand skills. So when you finish your A plus certification, then you're basically targeting this type of skills. This is the missing pieces from most of our certifications. And this is the missing information that a lot of people look for when they pass their certifications from anywhere and then they don't have a, a good way to actually uh, you know, go out and be confident because virtualization, domain, uh, CMD commands, how do you use it in real world environment, Office 365, a whole bunch of things, Outlook 365, Outlook troubleshooting, Azure for help desk, uh, you know, Spiceworks, PDQ, all this stuff makes value on your resume. And that is why people paid a lot of money to be able to take this, this training. So if you're interested in a full-blown video training, then I consider you to just just get the membership and do the learning path process. So of course that's way bigger than what you're seeing over here, but these are the, the core. This is the this is like the, the the area that we tell people that hey, you just joined our platform, you're not a member, you're not paying anything, but you want to go for that interview, then I think you should just go over, over this stuff quickly. You got one week, you should go over it and you should be good. You should have good understanding of how things are working for a help desk currently in 2020 right now. So they go over 1.0 1, 1 all the way to here. It does. It won't take 15 hours like this person because in, in live training, of course, we do a lot of, uh, you know, back and forth kind of thing. Somebody has to access the server. We have to tell them, guide them and all that kind of stuff. So it takes more time. It won't take you 15 hours to finish all this stuff. So this is the, the great content that somebody have worked really hard on. So if you click on it, it's very detailed. What I love about this documentation, it's very, very detailed detail step by step and you cannot miss anything so if you're using some different type of virtualization in your laptop like VirtualBox, then just learn this stuff and use the same uh, you know same process in VirtualBox. if you if you want to use the same uh, vSphere access then use this if you don't have access then buy it from us we have the ability to give you that access so but you, we have all the options for you this is all free stuff right here like i said a very powerful stuff right here that you just can't miss this
So that's number one, right? That was the first surprise that guys take advantage or you may not be guys just take advantage of this stuff. This is very powerful things. People pay a lot of money just to to do these things, you know. Um, so but make sure you go from the top like that just go from the top it makes more sense when you have to watch this playlist like for example why are we teaching this content why f what's the reason why did we even pick this specific content it has to show on your resume then that is being is explained in this playlist right here like why do we even care about these different type of skills as your uh, for spice works pdq why did even we mention that why didn't we just pick any other you know things right there so you need to watch you need to go with the flow like like i said you need to really go from top to bottom to really master these skills and to be able to be doing really good at interview now here's the big surprise for a lot of people we have created a whole full summary of a plus certification because we do believe a plus certification does give you that theoretical understanding that we don't teach like for example if you look at it that's compared to what a plus is teaching this is nothing but but a plus is teaching not teaching 90 percent of this stuff so that's missing from a plus so if you're one of those type of people that you didn't do a plus and you're like wow i'm just missing a lot of theoretical stuff but i want to keep everything for free right or maybe even if you're a premium member even if you're a plus member and you're like i don't want to go back to a whole learning path that you told me over here because i already did that and and now i forgot a few things because it's kind of big you know it's it's a lot of things in there right so you may just come in here click on this and look what we did for you we did we created the whole summary so this is the stuff that a paid member would get video access to right chapter one so they would get a video access but here what we what we want you to use this for is not for videos because our focus over here is quick thing right you want to get the like the answers quickly so for example if you think about troubleshooting somebody's going to ask you troubleshooting in the interview tell me the process of how do you troubleshoot as a technician so from here you can just quickly come over here because you know something is going to come with troubleshooting type troubleshooting and look at this you can just click on troubleshooting and now you got the whole steps right in front of you summarized identify the problem establish a possible cause test for a cause you see you, you got a plan right there and if you want to know what does what do i need to do with this like in troubleshooting there you go you got the steps in this format as well and you can go down to printer troubleshooting you can go to display right here you can go to different type of troubleshooting to find out how you can learn quickly based on that term and sometimes you may just click on okay printer man i i i, I i'm not good at printers so which printer do you want to know about managing printers do you want to know the types of printers? Do you want to know a laser printer? So it's not detail, right? We know that. But that detail stuff, you need to then invest and get a video. Maybe watch Professor Messer free videos if you want to do that. Or you just being a part of our member. That this is what we do for people. What I'm basically telling people is that we're into career development. We're into skills development. So we're going to use every single option, every single feature, every single thing that's going to make you a better IT professional, it's gonna make your life easy. So this is what we are doing for you, like these applications that we are buying and using it in a different format, just to make sure that when you are learning these things from our content, then we are adding a lot of good stuff around it. So when people are taking this course, this is actually a part of a course. This this is actually a part of our fundamental course. So they will have to come through this course. They'll watch the video, then they finish the video, then they for them this is more like a summary. Then right, they don't want to go back to the whole course again. So for them this is going to be a summary. But for you as a community member, whether you are a paid member or free member, you can come and utilize this to be able to get something out of it. So you could create a lot of things for yourself. For example, let's go back to troubleshooting over here like that example i can say basically let's just talk about troubleshooting um, uh, you know some people will throw questions so you can watch this you can open this slide and just think to yourself and ask yourself a question how many people can ask you a question about troubleshooting how do you identify a problem give me the steps so convert that question into too many different ways and now you got the perfect answer in front of you right you could have a visual answer in your head too or somebody can tell you exactly how okay tell me about the printer troubleshooting so now you you have these answers right in front of you very very quickly so 
this is only one link that I'm just going to share in my description because this link is everything for people who are finishing our courses, people who are joining our platform right now, but they don't have time. People whose interviews are like in two days, then what do you do, right? You may just want to quickly go over certain things to refresh it. But of course, the real thing is that if you want to do it the proper way, then maybe become a premium member and do the hands-on practice and everything is integrated. Like we, we basically kind of like, we tell you, okay, for this, you need to take that course. Let's just log into that with your username and password that we gave you. Let's take this video, take that video. Let's do this lab. Let's do that lab. This is what you call career development with counselors, career advisors. We are skills development platform. So we are then going very deep into like different things with a member, right? But this should solve many issues for us with where we don't have a good answer. Like we, we used to tell people, hey, if you didn't do this whole learning path, I don't know what to tell you. But here now I can tell a person, did you do A plus? Are you good at A plus? Do you know these things? Just go open it. Do you know all these things? Oh yeah, you're perfect at these. You, you love, you can smack this, you can smoke this, whatever you want to call that. You can do all that kind of stuff, but maybe you're not good at this stuff. So then just focus on the ports. Focus on the well-known ports right here, right? So just click on the ports, click on the browser troubleshooting, click on the Azure stuff, click on CMD commands. Maybe you're not good at commands, right? Maybe you're good at other things, but you're not good at commands. Uh, maybe you're not good at Active Directory. Just just go over that stuff. So you see how quickly you can then create that, uh, you know, that preparedness for you in this career. So this is what we're doing. I hope people like this stuff. Let me know what you think. When you click on this stuff, when you click on these blogs, when you click on this link right here, it takes you to this. Maybe search around. Try to try to create some questions in your head. Do you think it's working for you? What do you think? I want to know. How do you feel about these different type of features that we're playing around with? So I want to know from you. Let me know. What do you think? Thank you so much for all the support. And I'll see you guys in a different video.